Hi. In this video, in this presentation, I would like to in this video, in this presentation, I would like to show you how to use simple apple, one apple as a battery for for red, how to use salt water as a battery, how to make the combination or how to improve the voltage based on combination of zinc wire and copper wire and how to use only one tropical fruit as a battery in a much more efficient and simple way. First I will show you how to use the salt water for operation as battery and the principle, principle how to increase the voltage. When I put this copper and zinc wire, one is cathode, one is anode into salt water, we can see that this low consumption uh, watch is not operating. You can see it's not operating. It's because it is producing maybe only half volt this one battle and I need at least one volt to operate, not half of the volt. So what I will do, I will arrange the combination of these two glass of salt water. I will put copper here, zinc here and on the other side copper here and zinc here. Now it should operate. I will check it. Okay, you can see in this combination I increase the voltage to double and it's already approximately one volt and it's already operating. So in this way you can make the combination of very different fruit with one fruit or one sort of fruit or more fruit together. For example, when I take this apple, when it's only one apple and I will put this cathode and anode into the apple, I can see that it's not sufficient electricity for this operation. But in combination with lemon, when I put it in lemon here, when I will put this zinc wire in lemon, and when I may arrange the same, combi same combination as I was doing with salt water, I can see that the watch is operating, it should at least, yeah, it's operating already. So in this combination, I doubled the voltage as well and, the co and it's operating. But is this combination, this one volt sufficient for the LED, operation of the LED? I will, I will try whether it's, I will disconnect these wires and I will try whether it is sufficient for operation of LED. I will put the LED here and I can see, okay, there is no light, it's not operating. Okay, so I will put it aside and okay let's try to show how to use one apple for combination and to use it for this LED. I use for combination this one apple to combine copper wire, zinc wire, copper zinc so always put copper zinc, copper zinc and at the end I will put this zinc and copper wire and I will try. In this combination from an apple you always increase the voltage of each connection and we have already now battery from this apple. You can see in this combination you already, we already get sufficient voltage to light the bulb. You can try another bulb. Okay, you can see it's operating and it's producing sufficient light. But okay, this is very complicated, we should cut apple, we should connect apple and this battery is very complicated. But we have this tropical fruit and this tropical fruit can be used as a battery only as such. Okay, so now we will try to do it with this one fruit, we will do, okay. I will put the cathode and anode inside the copper and zinc and we will see whether it will operate. You can see it's okay. You can see there is an operation and it's 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 already working. Okay, the light is not, not uh, so bad and it's it's, it's quite stronger than in this apple. So in this combination we can arrange really with this tropical fruit we can arrange really higher voltage comparing to only one apple 
and what's very important it's only one fruit necessary for this light. That's all for today.